What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Age, let me eat that, Age of Engineering. Uh, so, last time we uh, did something. Oh, I moved I moved this smeltery over here. Uh, that's, don't worry about that. All right, last episode we set up this, this awesome thing. And I left it AFK for quite a while. Um, I actually, I just, like five seconds ago, I went and moved all this stuff over here. This power cube is here just because I had nothing to put on top of the fabricator. I think I still do have something of the squeezer or something. I, I don't use, I don't need to use this power cube anymore, especially since I moved it all here. All this stuff here, and I have my power right here. So I left it uh, AFK all night. I added more capacitors, so now we have 30 million RF total, or maximum, I should say. Um, and, yeah, so I have this hooked up. Uh, I left it uh, AFK. I let the power go all the way down overnight. I just, yeah, I just let it run. I actually got killed by a spider while I was AFK, but it's no big deal. I got my stuff. Um, I have this stuff because I was waiting till I got emeralds. I've been going to that and like taking emerald ore from it and and just breaking it. I'm going to show you what I got in a second. So I have eight emeralds and I don't know if I, I think I talked about this. If you do the whole block, it's, it's, it's cheaper. Yeah, I did talk about it. It's cheaper in terms of resources, not in terms of RF. It's a little bit more. You pay like the one extra. I just had this set up just because I thought I'd actually get it last night. And then I decided that even if I did get it last night, I, it would be smarter to not do that. I'd rather let it go AFK. It costs 24 million RF to do that. And that'll get me nine of the times eight solar panels, which is 72 RF per, per tick. I have been adding to this also. This, I'm just chipping away at this, chipping away, adding more. I could upgrade. I don't, I could. I want to upgrade to the tier three, but I need the weather crystal, which means I'm going to need more, more ender pearls to get it consistently. So today, I'm going to try to get an enderman farm going not like one to use regularly and not really it doesn't necessarily have to be an automated one it might just be like I punch them uh, I didn't actually look that far into it are there spikes in this pack spike there are spikes right it's actually tills two right I forgot I forgot what which mod pack I mean which mod uh, spikes were from just that arm doesn't kill doesn't say and these all I guess kill I'll drop experience mobs drop Prop, blah, blah, drop player kill only items. So the iron spikes are enough. Wow, these are actually not expensive. Yeah, we can go with iron spikes. Actually, hmm, maybe a better idea for Enderman because if we make an Enderman farm, there's gonna be Enderman all over. But anyway, uh, so this is what we've got so far, and yeah, that's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. I didn't have to mine for any of this. It was all just through power automation so basically I set that up and I just sit around and I get stuff so I don't have to really I hope to not go mine anymore we've got 13 emerald ore I've also broken a couple of those so we had a little bit more than that uh, I've gotten lead which I actually lead is really what I wanted I could put a focus in here for emeralds uh, I mean uh, instead of a clear lens a different colored lens uh, I'm not gonna bother if I FK I don't think it'll matter if I really need it then maybe I will but but whatever uh, I'm getting appetite ore, which is pretty cool. I haven't found that. Whoops. Let's grab the emeralds. This farm is off right now. It was on like five minutes ago, but um, we'll just do nine and put the rest back. And uh, yes, yeah, so let's break this. Let's try to make that uh, emeraldic whatever. Wow, that was a lot of emeralds just from that. Okay, that's awesome. That is awesome. 21 emeralds. Um, I was actually trying to save my emeraldic stuff, but I actually don't. I don't have any left. Uh, the reason why I'm not saving them anymore is because I looked at. Uh, let's just do one block. I looked at the cost. Whoops. Oh, what am I doing? I looked at the. What, what am I even talking about? I looked at, oh, not, not the cost. I looked at what uses it has. It doesn't really have any uses. Um, yeah, it just doesn't really have uses. Um, so I figured if I don't really need it for anything besides for, we'll, we'll look at it together. Uh, actually, can we? Yeah, we can. We go to this, go to uses. 
I can make the silk touch augment, which I already have, a fishing net, which I already have, a block, obviously, and the solar panel tier two, and that's all its uses. And then this thing can make this environmental controller. Um, I'm not sure what this does. I, I can see what it says, but I'm not sure if this is like a beacon or this is like a like for your world that your your because our tools creates dimensions. It does have beacons in the recipe, but uh, I'm not really sure. And then you can yeah, it has basically no uses. So besides for this, so we'll just let this go. It's gonna use basically all the RF. And uh, so I want to try to get the uh, the powered spawner. I don't have a broken spawner. But anyway, I need this slice and splice for the Z Logic controller. So I, I mean I can I can go mining and find a spawner somewhere. I I don't know if I found a spawner yet in this whole playthrough. Anyway, how many machine chassis do we have? We should have like one. We have one. And the recipe for this again, I need the seed oil. So now let's let's do this. Let's get the squeezer out. We we for sure have enough stuff. I've I've also uh, gone over to those greenhouses and they were basically almost all full. One of them wasn't, but I just put void upgrades in all of them. Oh no wait, they were all full. They were all of them were full. The string one isn't full because it already has the upgrade. What did I just do? I just I just picked up the block and placed it back down. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it this way. The way that makes sense. This power cube is totally useless now. Uh, I guess I can craft it into the extraction chamber or something. Uh, reinforced furnace, that's pretty cool. I would love to use this calculator. If there were a mod pack that like was more centered around the calculator mod, maybe maybe I would I would use it. But I don't know. I don't know how good it is, especially in the late game. Uh, so we need seed oil. Um, let us let us do that. Uh, where am I going? In order to get seed oil, we're gonna just go here and we're gonna grab all our wheat from the other farm. Uh, oh yeah, I also I don't know if I showed this, but I, I put like a bunch of stacks of, of coal, uh, five stacks of coal apparently, and I just left that while I was AFKing. And yeah, so now I've got stuff. Yeah, let's just take all of it. Ah, leaf block is still there, which is great. I'm, I might make a shrine for that. I'm not sure. <laughs> I feel like I feel like it's very fitting to make a shrine for that for that thing. Anyway, we're gonna go that, and then I can't do math. We'll just do this. 64, okay, whatever, whatever, this is fine. Uh, what if I put wheat in here? No, wheat doesn't go in here. Hmm. I guess I should just put more. Maybe I can make a bunch of, of machine chassis. Oops, I can just use W. If you hit W and, if you hold W and click, then, uh, it'll just put, uh, put it into the crap, the first available crafting uh, window or crafting slot I guess and it goes this 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 I think what's two uh, let's move all those up what's that dough three four yeah um, if you do it from down here it'll move it to this inventory it moves it to the next available inventory going upwards and then s moves it downwards and it wraps around apparently which I didn't know but I might use that now Okay. Uh, I suppose if I put those things, I've never used, uh, I've never upgraded any, uh, uh, what are these forestry machines? But I think that um, it's just those uh, circuit boards or whatever. Uh, so I'm gonna need more RF because I'm gonna need a uh, the sturdy casing. Bronze gear, item casing, and plate. I have one left over from the last time, which is a while ago we did that. But I still have uh, this. 
Also, I, I accidentally ended up somewhere along the line. I made two plate casts, which is kind of useless, but I guess I thought I lost it or something. Here's a gear, but I just I I I realized because I couldn't put I couldn't put uh, it in the pattern thing when I was the pattern chest when I was when I was uh, moving it. But then I, I realized that I had two and I just threw it out. Let it despawn. Okay, where's my bronze? It's over here. Let's put all this away. Yeah, I also still have all this hay bale, all these hay bales. So I have a lot of stuff, a lot of that stuff. Um. Okay. Need you. Need you. And then let's let's make another one, I guess. Okay. Um, uh, let's just wait for that. Ah, let's just go. Okay. I remember. I think I remember what the recipes. I don't need that water source anymore. Actually, let's uh, grab three dirt. I was using that water source so I can make uh, more of the wood pulp to make a lot of this conduit binder because I was running low. Um. There's a couple stuff we still have to figure out when it comes to doing that thing. Oh, that is done. Wow, word. That's awesome. I still have 10 million RF. That's wonderful. So I can still, I can do this. I can win. I feel great. I can do this. Um, okay. Cool. Um... I just noticed now that it's actually like the different color for, I guess it's the color of the, like, like that, that what I guess would be bronze, uh, orange, whatever, <laughs> not really bronze, but whatever, it looks cool. Um, I was going to make the, the uh, gear, but I got distracted. Okay, let us grab you. Hey. Oh, forgot. Forgot what this new these new stuff, this new 1.10 tinkers, it takes forever for it to to uh work. Uh let's put two of you here. Let us grab okay, what is it? It is copper. Let's use this copper because it's annoying me. One, two, three. Um and then I need oh no wait. I think I needed one copper. Yeah, it's, no wait, was that one copper? Yeah, it was one copper, right? Yeah, one copper. One copper and four steel. Um, I was looking into steel. It doesn't look like there's really any other way you can get it besides using like these annoying ways that last forever, that take forever, not last forever, take forever. Um, I was I was thinking maybe we could do it with the alloy smelter since we got to that age, but nope, nope. Tis not allowed. Tis not allowed. Um, no, I need you. And you go here, you go here, and then you go here. How much RF does this cost? Two million? No big deal. We got plenty of RF. Plenty. Plenty of them. Okay. Uh, I don't have a bucket. I'm gonna need one of them. Okay. Oh, I made a mistake. I used up all my rest empowered Restonia. Okay, we're gonna have to rectify that. We will have to rectify this. I knew I should have made more in preparation. I just kind of forgot about it. Let's see if I can remember. Yeah, I need these resonating thingies, which I used all of them. I, but you get them, you have a very small chance of getting them when you break redstone, it seems to be, at least, to me. Um, but uh, you can also do it with ender pearls, but I just don't have ender pearls. I do have a lot of redstone now that I am, yeah, I have, like, well, because I have all this, this stack in two, and then I have from whatever I got up there. I didn't actually check exactly how much I had. Let's see, it's the, uh, I remember it's rose red. Rose red. Um, 
Okay, red garnet, rose red, resonating redstone crystal. And can I remember? Can I remember? I uh, no, I cannot remember. I definitely cannot remember. Okay, um, Ardite, correct. I knew it. Actually, I didn't. I forgot, but I totally knew that. Um, let's just grab you. How much RF does this cost? Uses four million. No big deal. Oh, the weather's bad. Oh, my computer is asking me stuff. Let's uh ignore that. <clears throat> yep, and this one's red. That's very cool. Very cool. I did not really notice that. Hmm. So we're not even going to be gaining any RF back. Hmm. Let's see if it's nighttime. Maybe we can sleep. What's this? Free lava? Yeah. Yeah, no, it's not nighttime. What up, piggy? How's it going? Um. Okay, I'm definitely going to need that steel if I want to use solar panels. Although, I was looking into... I didn't look that far into it, but... Let's look at it now. Extreme... Oh, no, wait. I can't... Never mind. I was going to look at the extreme reactors. It doesn't look like it's that expensive. The reactor casing is not super nerfed like it is in, uh, in Infinity Evolved uh, Expert Mode. It was very, very nerfed in, in that pack. Which makes sense because it's such an easy, like, big reactors, well in this version it's called extreme reactors, but anyway, that mod is like, it's so good, it's so good, it's so powerful, like, you can, like, spend the first hour of your game, like, getting your tools, mining, you get enough to make, like, a 3x3x3, three by three by three, and then you're producing, like, a couple hundred RF per tick, which is, which is terrible for a big, for a big reactor, an extreme reactor, but for early game power that's amazing and then you just keep adding to it the only problem is it's not really self-sustaining you have to uh, you have to keep getting the yellow right and all that stuff but where's the yellow right where's the yellow right? I know I did see yellow right. oh here's some redstone a stack in the quarter um, yellow right here 27 okay so that's not that much but if you put the yellow lens you get you get a lot more it increases it by five percent which is great. Which is great. Um, but yeah, if you had it, if you had a big reactor or extreme reactor actually uh, powering this, you get tons of stuff, and you use this stuff to power the extreme reactor. And so one of all these things that you can get, one of those is enough to, or theoretically, is enough to sustain you getting the rest of all this stuff, which is pretty cool. It might be something worth looking into. I'm not sure. We're gonna have to look into that. We're gonna have to see exactly what's up with that. Uh, let's move the torches. So I have room to grab this. Yeah. So when it when it rains, these uh, operate at half efficiency. I'm only gonna have enough Restonia for one more. Maybe it's nighttime now. Um. But uh, what? Uh, I'm not sure what we can do. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna work on this powered spawner because enough time has passed from me doing just doing nothing. Um, let us grab this. Uh, this. Let us go on. I guess uses for this. I don't have the enriched gold. So all these stuff that I was that I was uh that I was having that were like uh what what was I looking at before that got took me straight to it? I don't even remember. Ah, uh, okay. What was I even doing? Oh, it was the copper electron tubes. Okay. <clears throat> Let's make one more. Uh, next we need the iron casing. Whoa. Right, all this stuff, like, like, the enriched gold, the redstone ingots, before it was like, I have eight gold left. 
I have. Okay, well, I have a lot of gold, but whatever. <laughs> I, I was I was running out before. Anyway, uh, and now that I have that automated mining, uh, free resources basically, you know, it just costs power. Uh, I'm not too worried about spending all my resources on stuff. Um, I just forgot what I was doing. Okay, I need this black quartz. Oh no, wait. Right, right. Um, that. Oh, it's. I think it's an advanced machine casing. It is an advanced machine casing. So I need steel plates, advanced alloy, carbon plates. <coughs> okay. Steel plates. Uh, carbon plates. Advanced alloy. Oh uh, wait, and then I need uh that. Anyway, yeah, all this stuff is <coughs> at this point it's no problem. It's no problem to get. Uh so yeah, that's that's good. That's awesome. Um I don't remember what order this was in. I think it was this. Okay, so now I've got these. Um, and I need iron bars. Yep, yep, iron bars. Oh man, my throat is like <clears throat> I cannot speak. I cannot speak. Okay, I need more iron bars. Do not have enough there. Only at seven. Sixteen. Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay. Okay, and now I forgot to get the bucket. And anyway, we just go like this, go like this. Uh, was it this? Did I get this right? Yeah, and those are regular iron bars. Just need seed oil. I have some buckets. I think I made extra buckets. Um, yeah. I only need one bucket. Okay. I didn't actually check how much seed oil I had. Let's look at it. Yeah, that's a lot. Uh, I wonder if I can. Yeah, I can. All right. And there's the machine chassis. And. Oops, let's grab these. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that uh, empower. I'm gonna leave it be for now. Uh, but now we have nine more solar panels. We just have to you know put the solar panels, the tier ones actually into it. Okay, now we're gonna make the slice and splice. Um, skulls. I should have plenty of skulls. There are my skulls. There's an Enderman head. I saw the skulls. They're over there. I don't have plenty. It can be any head. No, wait. I'm looking at the wrong thing. It can be any head. Okay. Solarium, Iron Axe, Shears. No problem. One, two, three, four, five. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Um, Two sticks. We will just do that. That. Let's just find the slice and splice. Bam. Um. This will stick over. I guess here. I don't. I don't really use the slice and splice that much. Something else I was going to show off was this. I forgot to mention. This is. Uh. This is a mending rod. I don't know if there's a way to disenchant. But whatever, and here's Soulbound. There's Lure and Protection, I just noticed that. But Soulbound is awesome. We can put Soulbound on something. That means if we die, it'll stay in our inventory. So if we get something like Draconic Armor, like 10,000 years into the future, um, we'll be good. We'll be good. Uh, okay, so now I need a Z Logic controller. Okay, let's get rid of all oh, both of these, because. Oh no, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what is Red Spawner? 
Powered spawner. Okay. <laughs> Red spawner. Okay, silicon, zombie head. I mean, solarium, silicon, zombie head, redstone. Do, 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 do. It was two solarium. Um, do I still have silicon in here? Yeah. Two of that. Was it iron? I think it was iron. No, it was a head. It was a zombie head. Okay, how many zombie heads do I have? Just one? Just one. Okay. And, okay, these vibrant crystals. Uh, yeah, I'm out of ender pearls. Hmm. That is terrible. Do I have vibrant? I think I don't have vibrant. I've only made enough vibrant to get by. So, I'm going to have to go hunt endermen. And we'll be back in a little bit. Alright, and we're back. And it's been a little little while. I've done a couple of things. I opened this up. Um, I went to the nether. Found a couple of blaze spawners and fortresses. And I made this. Um, that Those blocks are temporary. I need that to get up. Um, so there's spikes here. Here's a vacuum chest. It'll pull the items out. Here's item conduit. Going into these, I don't know. I just put three drawers, just just to, you know. I don't know what they drop. If they have any extra drops, uh, and I'm gonna put the spawner against here. Cover that up. Ooh, I need one more piece of glass. Okay. Uh, oh, I barely barely missed it. Um, so we're gonna try to get this done real quick. So let's grab. Uh, oh, I have clear glass already. Oh man, what a mistake. <coughs> anyway, uh, I've got. Powered spawner right here. Let's grab uh, my broken spawner and let's grab. Oh, I think I forgot to make the soul binder. Hmm. Huh. Huh. So let's let's uh just wait. Where's my Enderman? There he is. Um, a powered spawner and an anvil. Set type, which would make make it a blaze. Okay, so let's just see, uh, soul binder. Oh, I forgot to mention, I made a manual and cleaver. It's all out of manual. I put, uh, three things of, uh, three levels of lapis, so it has, uh, looting three, and I put two levels of mending moss. So it basically repairs itself just from punching mobs in the face. Okay. Uh, machine chassis. All the heads. All the heads. So you. You and now that I have the cleaver, I can uh, I can get heads much easier because it has like a twenty percent chance to be heads. So that's how I got two wither skeleton skulls. I wasn't even going for them. Um, let's go one, two, three, four. Let's do that. I found a couple of stuff also. I found this thing, a found capacitor. It looks like I don't know. It looks like it's like a like a like a capacitor to upgrade the Ender IO machines, but it's it's different because you find it. I don't know. I don't know the power of it. I don't know how how powerful it is. But anyway, uh, we'll just stick it up here. Um, that'll be eight. Okay. Oh, you hear those sounds? Those are some creepy sounds. All right. So we're gonna just have to wait a couple of seconds. Oh wow. That is so cool. This never happened in 1.10. This this did not this did not do that. This definitely did not do that. Uh, that is really cool. So I guess we'll wait. Uh, I kind of just brought us back for this. Do I want to really stop recording and then start again? Five seconds later, it's already a quarter of the way done. Um, let's see if there's anything else we can do. Um. It doesn't say how much RF it uses. Uh, I may as well grab some of these. Uh, some of this. All uh, oh right, I moved them to here. Let's fix that. Solidified experience. That's what it's called. <clears throat> okay. So 50% done. Not bad. Not bad. Um, I mean the episode's kind of going long. All my episodes go long. I'm trying to make them not go so long. 
I thought I like that's why I built all of this off camera because I figured like I could walk you through it but like it's not that complicated you just make a box um, I don't know if there's a way to get Enderman to not teleport it might be maybe the aversion obelisk does that I'm not sure I think the aversion obelisk just prevents like it it just sends mobs away I don't know so this is yeah it looks like one full rotation one full 360 degree turn is what it takes for it to complete so that's pretty cool um, this is draining RF hmm oh wow because this is doing a thousand RF per tick okay but that's fine it's only gonna be temporary Um, I didn't end up adding any more solar panels. I'm gonna do that after the after I finish recording. I'll I'll probably do that. I'll probably make more emratic, uh, the empowered uh, emerald emerald stuff. Whatever. I'm probably gonna do that. Now I'm getting. Right. Is this done? Yeah, this is done. So let's take that. Put that in there. Let's take this. Now I have an Enderman spawner. Now combine an anvil. So we'll go over to our anvil. I'll put you here and you here. 16 levels. No problem. We'll just right click a couple more times. And there we go, exactly 16 levels. That will make it an Enderman spawner. So blah, 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 blah. Okay. So let's put you away. Uh, Soul Vial, I will keep on me. I probably am going to want to catch. Uh, a witch or or something or an enderman I don't know I want to make because I'm gonna need those for uh, other stuff you actually can't use your offhand it says it requires uh, where does it say it I don't know where it says it but it's supposed to say somewhere it uses two hands I think it was it was in the thing itself whatever anyway uh, yeah that's good that will leave. We will grab one more conduit. We will connect it. 1600 RF a tick. Okay, so um, we're not producing nearly enough RF for that. Um, okay, the thing. Uh, so this is gonna have to be put on hold temporarily. Give me all that stuff. Okay, so in order to turn this off, we just go over here. I've connected it from a different conduit. I could have used the next tier conduit, and but whatever, it doesn't matter. We're not producing enough power anyway. But now that I see how much it costs, it looks like I'm gonna have to change it over because uh, it only does 640 RF per tick. But um, let us uh, should we let it go? Now nah, we're gonna not let it go. Uh, we're just gonna screenshot this. It would be cooler if it were filled with Enderman, but whatever. I made it big. I don't know why I made it so big. I didn't have to. I could have just made it like uh just that glass where the glass is in in on the inside and taken out this whole outside. But whatever. Give some sort of structure. It's all hooked up. Also, the 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 conduit goes down there. It was uh, over here to the wall, and then it goes here. There was a whole line of dirt. You would have been able to see it, but now you can't see it at all. It all um, turned back into grass. But anyway, so we get we did something really important today, which was set up this thing. Even though we can't use it, it's still very important to be able to spawn Enderman. We just go click, and we turn on. Uh, well, it's not that simple. We have to go and configure that and uh, basically click. Yeah, and uh, <laughs> it will... Uh, give us uh, more power, uh, I mean more, en give us Endermen, so those Endermen are going to be useful for getting the next the next stuff, um, and now we have a weapon, which is 18.2 attack damage, which is awesome, but uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today, uh, thank you guys for watching, maybe maybe in the next episode we'll, we'll go to the end, uh, I'm, still, I'm still thinking, I, I did prepare some stuff for a crossbow, I have the bow limb, the plate, the binding, whatever. I have stuff for the, the crossbow. I'm probably going to do that next episode. I have to look into which ones are powerful. But with this cleaver, we're going to be good. We're going to have to get elytra. 
We're gonna need ender pearls, obviously. We're gonna I'm gonna need more power. And once we get enough power, uh we'll probably go to the end. That's probably the way it's gonna be. It's so if we have like if we're producing enough RF, at like at least sixteen hundred RF per tick, so that we can run that. But anyway, yeah, so that's gonna be it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. And we will see you. Let's turn the glider on. In the next one. What was that noise? Oh. Hey. It's spawning Enderman. I gotta go uh, figure that out. But yeah, we'll see you next time. Peace.